Hi, Dr. Paul Hader here. Now the future of mankind is love. There's no doubt about it. Within our own lifetimes, within the next 15 or so years, we will see a shift away from all these corporations, away from businesses, away from money, and towards love. The old idea of having money and needing money will disappear. The idea will shift to how can I help you? How can I love you? How can I be there for you? We've had the ability to feed everyone on this planet forever. We've had the ability to house everyone on this planet forever. And now it will finally take shape. It will form and become coalesced into reality. We know that God is true love. And those that are full of greed will fade away. Those who are full, full of anger will fade away. And we will be left with an open heart at that point. And it is going to be a little bit difficult getting there, but in the end it's really going to be worth it. We are going to see amazing changes. Everyone will have everything they need in every way, shape, and form. And the calling card of our heart will be this. How can I love you a little bit more? How can I love you and make a change in your life? How can I love you and make life easier for you in some way. And if someone needs something and, and we see somebody in distress, everyone will come run, running to that person to help them. Not like now where nobody comes or one or two person, people come. Everyone will come running. Things will change. Things will be totally different. Life will be different. You know, the idea of nations will kind of dissipate. The idea of, you know, different creeds and religions and all these different things will kind of just melt down into something that's really not as important as it used to be and become something that is a memory. And we will become nothing but pure love deep down inside. And that love will spread throughout the world like wildfire. Because at that point, we're tired of it. We're tired of hate. We're tired of anger. We're tired of rage. And we want something different. We want nothing but love and caring. And we're getting to that point. You see people doing this now. And they are the pivotal people who are, will spread this word and it will take off like wildfire and there will be particular people who will ignite in thousands upon thousands of people to go in that direction and their heart will be filled with love so powerful that 90,000 when they're in their presence will be ignited with love and change the direction of mankind. And these people are coming. They are destined to be here. And you are one of those. It's time to say no more to all the greed, to say no more to all the hoarding of money, and say yes to love. This is the destiny of the world. For God is love, we are love, and God lives within our heart, and how can we be anything else but true love? We will heal the oceans, and the fish will no longer have plastics within them. We will heal the skies, and there will be no more pollution. We will heal all the different lands that grow crops that are full of toxic chemicals. 
and our food will he be healed and be whole and be true and be healing to thy body. This is our destiny. It is absolutely no other destiny that we will have. And this will go on for ten or more generations. This is what we have to look forward to. And we will work, if you want to call it work, at what we love. And society in general and the whole world will deem that whatever you love to do will be what's important for the community. Because from there, if you are an artist, you bring love and light to the world. If you are a doctor, you bring love and light to the world, whatever it is. If you are a farmer, you bring love and light to the world. And so it is that we will change the face of mankind from that of poverty and homelessness to that of peace and interconnection to the one and only. This is our destiny, and we shall make it happen. For God lives within. I love you.